G'day installers, today I'm assembling an eco rail splice between two sections of our new Elite Rail. To do so, I'll be using my DeWalt impact driver and I'll set it to the mid torque setting as the 8mm hex head bolts need to only be fastened between two and four Newton meters, which will achieve by a single tap of the trigger. This has been tested and has passed for electrical continuity. What's key when installing your Eco Rail Splice on the Elite Rail is that the splice is rotated so that the middle rib sits in the bottom of the connection point. With just one tap, the assembly is together. Now I'll grab my digital torque wrench to check that the bolts are fastened between two and four Newton meters. Each brand of impact driver's torque and settings are different. Please check your impact driver to see how you can achieve the specifications of a maximum of four Newton meters when installing the Eco Rail Splice between your sections of Elite Rail. And make sure you verify it for yourself by using a torque wrench. This single tap install is super efficient. Here's a mid clamp and I'm going to run it through the Elite Rail and you'll see it's rigid in the rail and there's no excessive side to side movement when the 8mm hex head bolt is fastened between 2 and 4 Newton meters. Now if the 8mm hex head bolt was over tightened, the Elite Rail will splay open and you'll run the risk of your Z module detaching. Therefore, only ever fasten the 8mm hex head bolts between 2 and 4 Newton meters. And remember, always rotate your PV Easy Rack Eco Rail Splice so that the middle rib sits at the bottom of the connection point. There it is, a section of Elite Rail spliced in my hands. I used the Eco Rail Splice, I rotated it, set the 8mm bolts in fastening between 2 and 4 Newton meters. If you want to grab some of this beautiful Elite Rail or any other Clenergy products, certainly go to one of our authorised distribution partners to pick up any of your PV Easy Rack products. And if you want to know how to install the products or you have any other questions, certainly just reach out to our technical team anytime.